Hello, boys and girls. My name is HotzoC and welcome back to Oxygen Not Included. Uh, last time we started to wreck up uh, our steel because we want to build furniture. Or more precisely, we want to build a monument which needs about 15 tons of steel. So even for the first stage, we are not even half there. However, we also have a problem with this stress. We have too much. And what I think we want to do is provide nicer lodgings for our duplicants and to do that we will for one put in here a floor we will deconstruct this we will deconstruct that we will dig this out and then we shall have four tiles going down there. And we also will have this going over here. And we have an issue with our heavy wad wire which goes smack bang here through our base that's not that nice here on this side i managed to place all the uh, conductive wires with aluminium but i think we do not have enough yet um, to also do that here on the other side but we can start because we want to pull that off through here and then I think with connective wire we should be able to uh, supply all the power for our base. And then we have to somehow bring that over to this side where we need more of it. So, uh, probably we can then directly hook it up to here. And there we probably can have something like that on the lower side. But all this takes time. And we have a trapped duplicate, so please build me uh, that floor there so that the duplicate can get unstuck before we run out of uh, oxygen. There we go. more research done but not completely yet let's have a look uh, where we stand yeah we are completing uh, just the uh, odd research that we have not covered we will not go into the space research at all but uh, let's finish this thing up here and then we probably also want to have a floor right here and dig all this up so we can continue with the floor there and 
lot of these things are not growing because we are lacking water or we just have too much to do but that's basically just a matter of uh, of time lower floor is now in we still have a lot of uh, stress some more electro wires are constructed and i also started uh, having conductive wire going in here so that once we have hooked this part up we can then basically supply our whole base with uh, <coughs> the transformer from down here and here on this side the uh, atmos huge stocks i powered with this transformer which was previously powering the setup over here but we have a dedicated one standing there now so there is still a lot of things to do also to clean up this mess and we can see we have quite a bit of carbon dioxide uh, sitting here uh, i'm hoping that eventually the carbon skimmer can deal with that but there as said is still a while to go the cleanup worked um, somewhat so now we can actually plan out our rooms so i want to have a large marble block in here then of course a confu bed um we will then have another sculpting block there and we will have a pneumatic door made out of uh, gold amalgam and then this wire here on top that will go um, we will have a bit of uh, decoration there made out of uh, granite right and we will have two paintings and that's basically the setup that we will have and then we will build up one room after the other until our space is filled here and probably that will happen after only four rooms they are quite spacious uh, yeah and on the last one do not even manage to get the last piece of uh, statue in there but yes that's how it will look and i have planned out all the wiring down here if we connect to there then we have this cable going up here and we can disconnect all this and then we only have to hook up this one 
and make the connection there. But for that we need still a bit more uh, aluminium uh, to complete the whole thing. And looking at the decor, while we have this around zero-ish decor up here in these rooms, we are deep in the negative in here because of that wire. So we have to remove the wire first before we can consider assigning any duplicates to these new rooms and that of course will take time at this point we are dealing with various stress reactions from vomiting to uh, crying out tears but we are getting there uh, up to this point we have the wire connected which means we can deconstruct this one and once we have that piece connected there and we can also disconnect this one or destroy this one and then all we have to do is build this wire then we have the connection up to here and we can get rid of this ugly piece of wire which should then allow us to let duplicates move in here and if we have a look at the decoration um, in here there we are positive there we are positive but on the outer two we are still in the negative and that's mainly due to the to the heavy watt wire so um, let's yep we have connected that piece there so let's do that and then just cancel this uh, this wire we don't need anymore and that transformer we don't need anymore and even down here they are busy um, putting the wire in and eventually we will pull the wire all the way over here and then I think here we go up connect to this one and then we can mm, maybe we go around somewhere there we will see but we have connected this part so now let's do the big thing deconstruct all that and that and that and then we can fill in the gaps here and let the duplicates move in um, yeah and I assume this once again will take a while down here I have set up a carbon schema because we have a bit uh, high pressure here and also here we have an additional door separating this so we can better control pressure in this room um, so that we can still run the oil refinery 
Um, while this natural gas geyser is also producing gas. So let's once again jump a bit forward in time and see where we stand once we have cleaned up this ugly wire. All our rooms are now complete and cleaned out. And if we take a look at the overlay, we can see they are nice and green and they have a maximum decor reached of 120 points. So I think now it's time to uh, assign these new fancy beds to some people. Um, and then we basically can clean, clean out these ones and have Some more going on here and then of course we need to extend that to there we need to dig this part out um, we probably also want to dig this out then we want to have a door there as well and then we just copy the thing up from below ah. here we don't have a door and we don't have tiles we have this here and then we have some crown molds there 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 and then as well on the other side up oh, but not there it's the wrong button then some small paintings over the bed there we go have the bed there then a marble block there and that's that and we have some crown molding there and there and we have this going on there that goes here we have another door there we have that and that we have another block there there we have images we have crown molding or, or corner molding and crown molding and then of course this goes all the way up here and there we actually have an, a proper wall going up. Right. So here we also then need to clean up. And there we want to have a bit of floor going on. 
and with that we should see the stress level going down uh, and the uh, ugly mishaps like vomiting and crying no longer happening over on this side you can see I started out planning the heavy wood wire to this side and we can go through here and then um, up there uh, to connect the, the whole thing once we get the required aluminium so that's probably uh, something that I will do until next time uh, also build up the steel supply so that next time we can actually start with the final project of the statue of the monument so hope you enjoyed this episode and join me next time it's goodbye for now <laughs>